And here we go guys, thanks for tuning in to my latest racing video, running my Schumacher Cougar LD2, supplied by Model Sport, best model shop in the UK to get all your RC gear. So here we go, qualifying round four, a Pendle and District Model Car Club Summer Series 2023 round one. Feels so good to be back at this track, I was last here, last here, last summer. For, um, for an event they put on and now they're doing a championship sponsored by CML Distribution. Very challenging track, very slippy track. Let's see who we've got on the starting grid. So we've got Chris Smith on pole, Chris Tonk second, Scott third, Graham fourth, Oliver fifth, Chloe sixth, me seventh, Charles eighth and Carl in ninth. Hopefully we can have a good race, better one than um, qualifying three. Yeah boys, let's jump straight into it. So tracks ride out quite a bit. Change from um, silver cut staggers and silver mezzos to yellow cut staggers and yellow mezzos front and rear. Starting to feel a little bit more grip now. we go down the straight up, up through the banking very tricky this top part of the track depth of field and all that nice over the double double two cars in front have a bit of a coming together through this slippy back section you can see where the astro tape's a bit worn down in places very hard to get the power down with these two wheel drive buggies cars crashing out have a bit of a tangle there nice through that corner this tricky bump and then into the corner lap one's a 41.66 over the double double Got a clear track around me now. Catching up to this car in front. Looks like it might be a decent lap this one. There we go, fastest lap of the race of 35.10. My fastest lap of the race. Through the chicane. Looking like another good one if we don't make any mistakes. Car in front gets out of shape. So currently in fifth, lap three was a 36 21. Get out a little bit there. Car behind's closing me down. Bit heavy on the jump. Lap four is a thirty-seven twenty-one. Over the double double. Run a bit wide. Someone's crashed out. Bit of a pile up. I come off better off. Very deep into that corner. Lap five is a thirty seven ninety two. Get a bit out of shape on the street. Cars fish sailing round. About halfway through the race now. Through the chicane.
Car in front crashes out again. <laughs> Two cars crashed out. Get this lap done. Lap six is at 37.83. And we go a bit deep into that corner. This car's right on my tail. Nice line through the chicane. Quite a decent race so far. Still, still feel a little bit off the pace. Up seven is a thirty-six oh one. Probably would have been an advantage just to maybe run a bit of turbo for the straight, but it's kind of so slippy you might end up spinning out. As someone's just on there on the street. Through the chicane, through the second chicane, down to this hairpin. There goes the buzzer. So, might have time to get an extra lap in. Lap 8 is a 35, 34, 54. Get this last lap done, spin out a bit there. Love the double double. Through the chicane. Through the second chicane. And we go over the finish line. Lap 9 is a 35.58. So onto the results, Graham won it with 9 laps and a fastest lap of 33.45. Chris was second with 9 laps and a fastest lap of 31.97. Scott was third with 9 laps and a fastest lap of 34.03. Chris was fourth with 9 laps and a fastest lap of 31.47. I was fifth with 9 laps and a fastest lap of 35.10. So we're about 2 seconds off the leader. Chloe was 6th with 8 laps and a fastest lap of 35.88 and Carl was 7th with 7 laps and a fastest lap of 39.01 Oliver was 8th with 7 laps and a fastest lap of 39.23 and Charles was 9th with 7 laps and a fastest lap of 40.29 So yeah, mid-pack finish Gotta be happy with that On to the lap times Decent lap, lap 3 was okay, lap 7 was a bit off the pace, lap 5 was a bit off the pace, lap 6, but yeah, kind of like mid 30s a lot of the laps, so consecutive 3 in round 3 was 117, consecutive 3 in round 4 was 107, so we knocked 10 seconds off, um, knocked about 2 seconds off our best lap, and our average in round 4 was 37, our average in round 3 was 44. So yeah, knocked a lot of time off. Overall, overall, guys, I'm happy with that result. Onwards and upwards. Next, it's the finals, which is going to be a two-round final. So make sure you tune in for that. As always, thanks very much for tuning in. I'll see you in the next one. Oh, yeah.